Meanwhile, trade union Solidarity has launched a public campaign against South African Airways. It's accused the carrier of racism, saying it failed to accept white male candidates into its cadet program. SAA announced the candidate candidates for the program earlier this week. The group of 40 men and women will undergo 14 weeks of training before obtaining their pilot licenses. The national carrier says its decision was entirely guided by the Employment Equity Act. It says under the Act, the selected candidates are defined as previously disadvantaged. SA spokesperson Tlali Tlali has called on the trade union to engage in talks with the airline. We are trying to redress you know, the injustices and the imbalances of the past. And if they sat down with us and inquired from us what is it that we are trying to do, they would understand exactly what we are doing. As I indicated initially that a point of departure is a focus on PDIs. That is not at the total exclusion of any other racial groupings. And this is how it works in critical terms. If we have about 10 slots and then you are focusing on PDIs and you are able to accommodate eight out of that ten and then you have white males who are successful you will be able to accommodate two of those in that which we you are doing secondly he makes reference to an incident which is an unfortunate one which we acknowledged that happened last year when the male applicants the white males for for, for that matter applied they were rejected that was brought to our attention. We corrected that number one and number two, we granted an extension for the white males to apply. Solidarity, meanwhile, says it understands the injustices of the past have to be corrected in all work sectors, but the union's Dirk Herman says this has to be done in line with the law. Address that situation, but we must do it according to the Constitution and the Employment Equity Act. You can't be selective. The Constitution and the Employment Equity Act does not allow absolute exclusions like they do now. You can't exclude a whole racial group simply on the base of race.